Well, finally, some good news in the ongoing saga of bad record keeping by Shelby County Clerk Wanda Halbert. Shelby County Trustee Regina Newman says after state auditors poured over all the numbers, a new financial report is now accurate and has the blessing of the Tennessee Comptroller's Office. Today, Halbert turned over $8.7 million in wheel tax revenues, money that's supposed to help pay to rebuild Regional 1 and two new high schools. RJ Shakur is live at one of the clerk's offices tonight to verify why the wheel tax collections may not be enough for those projects. Jay? Your money, millions of tax dollars collected in the form of the expanded wheel tax were, until now, unaccounted for. But now that records are updated and signed off by the trustee and state officials, what now? Is the $25 Shelby County wheel tax generating enough revenue to finance big county projects? Our sources? the Shelby County Trustee's Office, the Tennessee Comptroller, and the Shelby County Commission. One thing we know is taxpayers have their doubts. I don't know how it got so bad. I mean, there doesn't seem to be any accounting, but they're, they're, I mean, accounting in the sense of accounting for like, this is going here and this is going here. The Shelby County's clerk's office is the second highest revenue generator in the county. Their updated reports show a tax revenue grand total of more than $56 million raised from last July to February of this year. About 8.7 million of that came from that $25 wheel tax increase that went into effect last year. That money was supposed to help the debt servicing for a new regional one and two new high schools in Fraser and Cordova. But at this point in the year, the county was hoping closer to $12 million would have been collected. That leaves the county about $3 million short of its goal. So no, the will tax isn't generating enough revenue, at least right now. But the answer needs context. It's not that these projects won't happen, but the county may have to look at other sources to make up the difference. That will be determined during the budget process. By law, the county has to have a new budget by July 1st. By the way, the state Auditors say that the clerk is not in the clear just yet. The state comptroller likely will issue a final report of all of its findings late next week. With your Verify, I'm Jay Shakur.